Hey Leo, so I'm gonna do a reading for you guys. We are gonna see what your messages are at this time. Just keep in mind, it is a general reading. Do not force this message to fit your situation, okay? Thank you guys for your love and your support on the channel. I really do appreciate you all. We're gonna go ahead and get started. And we're gonna see what your messages are, okay? So the chariot is here. All right, Cancer. Energy is coming through. I feel like if you've had any obstacles um, in regards to your love life, I feel like you are overcoming those. It feels like your path is very clear. If you've had any type of blockages or anything that was preventing you or you know stopping you from connecting to love, it feels like that is over or you're going to start to notice that you're connecting to more people that have value, more people that are, I'm hearing like, more tasteful people, all right? And this is because you've been working on yourself, you've been changing, so what you're attracting is changing as well, okay? I feel like when you're walking outside, you're, you're definitely noticing... Um, people are a lot more friendly or you're getting a lot more compliments, okay? So you can really tell that, you know, the path that you're on in regards to, I guess, like how open you are to love. Um, you can tell that whatever steps that you're taking, you can tell that it's benefiting you, okay? All right. Um, judgment is here. So the path, okay, so I see you getting to a point in your, on your path to your journey to love or whatever where um, you're being faced with something from your past, you know? Something that you may have not, okay, so something that you really had to take a lot of time to overcome. So for example... This could be the fear of abandonment, you know, feeling like you're always going to be left, feeling like no one cares about you, no one loves you. That could have been something that you really had to overcome. All right, so I see you overcoming. I see you being honest with yourself, being real with your situation. Okay, the Eight of Wands, Two of Wands, yeah, the Seven of Swords. I'm not going to take all of these. I'm just going to look at them, look at it real quick. Yeah, like moving too fast. So this is just like the past issues. Moving too fast. Um, jumping from, you know, maybe one relationship to the next. Maybe not, you know, maybe cheating on people. Or, you know, just not being honest with yourself. Those are things that you had to overcome. So I'm just seeing now where you currently stand. Those were past issues. You overcame that or you're overcoming that now. Okay, whatever your issues are surrounding love. Spirit is saying that like, you're on the right track. Two of Cups. So this this is you connecting to people that are or a person that is um, you know more your speed now. <laughs> I feel like uh, yeah, this is somebody that you can have a meaningful conversation with. This is someone that you enjoy spending time with. I'm laughing because I feel like more your speed now is completely opposite of what you used to do or how you used to entertain people like in the beginning or you know in your past maybe you rushed into relationships very quickly maybe you know you took things things escalated you know very quickly or you didn't take time to get to know the person you know so it's like you may have jumped or skipped some steps and getting to know a person now you may consider yourself like rare or a lot more mature than people in your age group, all right? Or you may you may think that you were fast before and now you're kind of slow, like not fast in a I don't know, like yeah, I guess fast, like you're moving too quick and now you 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 know, like you want to take your time, you want to get to know who you're with, what you're doing, like it's the complete opposite of what you used to do. So, this is good. This is a good thing, you know, like I'm talking to somebody who takes the time to really see who's in front of them. Okay? Like you want to you want to you want a deeper connection. So that's what's happening. 
all right? Um, because you decided to overcome whatever those issues that you were dealing with from your past, all right? So this is good to see. This is a good uh, energy. I also see four swords here. For some of you, like, you're fine being by yourself until you connect to people that are more meaningful, okay? The shallow relationships, the, you know, superficial connections, they don't really do anything for you. That's what I'm seeing. And you're cool spending time by yourself until you get, you know, this type of soulmate energy, this type of, you know, bond that you're, um, I'm hearing, like, craving. That's what I'm hearing. Okay. I see the page of cups here at the bottom. All right, so be on the lookout. I feel like you're in a good space. You're in alignment to connect to the type of relationships or connections that you want. Okay, I don't see you sweating yet. I don't see you worried or concerned or anything like that, which is a good thing. Okay, um, let's pull from another deck. All right, Spirit, can you tell me more about love for the collective? <laughs> yes, you have definitely changed. I see that. All right, Spirit. What else do you have for the collective? Thank you. So, palm tree says stability, security, permanence, growth, endurance, flexibility. And then it came out with... Love call. Love call. It says someone expresses love, a message of love, thinking of you and letting you know. Okay, let's do two more. I have two more. We have photograph. Hmm. So looking at your photos, missing you, nostalgia, make new memories. There's somebody here that's definitely thinking of you, past energy. I did a, you know, a love reading before this and I was picking up on a past person. So this definitely could be the same energy here. But there's somebody from the past that wants to, you know, talk to you, reconnect, possibly, if you're open. And I have, thank you, Spirit. So this one, let's see, is mask. It says, not showing true feelings, hide, personify, pretend, delude, gaslighting. And I see camera here, reminiscing, keepsake, perception, learn from the past, make memories. Yeah, so... Somebody, okay, it's gonna, you know, it's a general reading. So if you don't want a past person, then you don't have to take a past person. I think sometimes people make readings more difficult, you know, than they need to be. If, if you're hearing about a past person coming up and you know you want absolutely nobody from your past, then if, if that's not what that is for you. It could even be like a past life connection. It doesn't have to necessarily be somebody that you dealt with before. But I'm strongly picking up on somebody wants, um, there is a past connection for somebody here that you've dealt with before. Okay. You may be, I'm seeing like cool off that with the four of swords. Like I don't want that. I don't, you know, I don't want to deal with that. I'm improving. I'm bigger. I'm better. <laughs> I'm better than, you know, I used to be. You're moving in a new way. All right. Yeah, but you're not the only one that's moving in a new way, all right? There's other people, there's people from your past that are growing, all right? So, let's just see. Spirit, tell me more about these two of cups. Let's see who this is. This is someone that you enjoy, all right? You're going to have um, a lot of fun with this person. You're going to... You're going to want to be around this person. So if you're thinking about somebody that you know and you can't see that happening, then that may not be your message. Okay, but I, I feel like this is someone that um, you do want to be around. This is someone that you want to get to know, okay? You guys may be an older couple, okay? Or, again, like you guys just may... You may have done a lot of growing. You guys are a lot more mature now. <laughs> I'm seeing like um, you guys talking about what you used to do back in the day. Like how wild you guys were. Okay. Somebody was fast. I'm seeing that here. Moving too fast. Yeah. Two, this is the two of cups. Soulmate. Same type of energy. So this is someone that you would be 
you would want to talk to you want to invite this person in and that's what i'm seeing okay this is a connection where you guys just flow you know there is there is no issue with this person if it was it happened so long ago it's not an issue anymore this is somebody that you may still you may have their photo you may t um talk to them okay i don't know how you talk to them but i'm seeing like um yeah you guys may be talking right now you guys may be like reconnecting talking over the phone um yeah like let's make new memories let's like let's do let's do new things i see you and this person wanting to um yeah like explore each other that's what i'm hearing explore new sides all right new sides of each other you guys are both in agreement this is a yes okay let's put the past in the past all right so some of you are deciding to reconnect to a past person and you're just you know letting it letting the past stay where it's at and moving forward all right so this may be i'm also seeing it could be a, a an up and coming conversation so this person may be reaching out again um i see love calls someone expressing love um, a message of love thinking of you letting you know okay so this person wants to reach out okay or you want to reach out tell me about love call hmm love call Yeah, they've been, they have been watching, they have been thinking, they've been looking at your photos, they've been re-examining the connection, okay, reminiscing for sure, yep, reminiscing, there's something that they may have of yours, it could be like a movie ticket or it could be a photo, um, something that I'm seeing like from an event, okay, yeah, they keep this. They hold on. <laughs> they keep this. They hold on to this. All right. Let's see. What else do you need to collect? Yeah, and I feel like you can tell. This is, again, this is connection. Because I'm picking up the same energy that I did from a love reading I just recently did. Okay? Like a few hours ago. Um, This is someone that you have history with. All right? You can tell who this... You know who this person is. You can tell that they're thinking of you. You can tell that um, they want to reach out. Okay, or this is what this person is seeing, seeing about you, okay, or this is what you, you know, you both are able to tell about each other that you both want to reconnect, all right? And it kind of feels like this time around, things are going to be a lot more secure than they were in the past if you're open, if that's what you want, you know? I'm going to pull from another love deck. So, is there anything else you need the collective to see about this connection? Anything else you need the collective to see? about this connection anything else spirit we have free yourself it's time to take back control of your life with that chariot card that's exactly what you did i feel like you know not just with this connection but like relationships in general maybe there was a certain way that you used to behave you know, like maybe you rushed into things too quickly. I can say for myself, I definitely did that. I just didn't really take my time to get to know a person. Um, just kind of wanted to get to the end. And that always backfired. And so now I'm a lot more cautious. So I really take my time when I'm connected to anybody. Not just in love, but just with people in general. That could be something that you had to learn about yourself. So, you know, whatever you've been working on internally this is benefiting you i feel like you have a lot more control when it comes to who you want to date what type of you know relationship you want to have like you understand yourself more and what you want um in love okay and that's working for you you're connecting to people that are in that same energy okay all right so even if it's not a past person and this is a brand new person this is someone who's had their own you know set of past experiences that help them grow and evolve and understand what they want in love so this is a good thing so however it goes for you if you're interested in love and if you're ready to recon reconnect or if you're ready to connect to somebody spirit is saying be open all right to stay open all right thank you spirit so it says this could be the one you've already met the romantic partner you see so for some of you this is a past person that you've already you know dealt with before in some way it may be you know Maybe you guys didn't have a full relationship. Maybe you did. Um, but for some of you, this is like a past connection. 
Yeah, reconciliation. It says someone from your past is returning to your life. All right. Okay. Someone from your past is returning. So, you know. You know how to handle it. You know what to do. <laughs> I want to see if I have, like, another love deck. I don't really have. I noticed that I don't have much mini love decks. Mm. I'm going to have this one. I like this deck, though, but I don't always use it. I don't know. Let's just see. All right. I'm going to pull just a few from here, and then I'm going to wrap this up because the, the message is, is kind of, you know, it's the same. It's a past person coming back. This person may be a little bit, you know... Okay, so this person may be, they may be ready a little better than they were from the, from the past or a lot better. Okay, depending on who you're connected to. Alright, let's just see. I'm also seeing, I didn't really clarify this mask card. So there, I don't know if this is you or your person, but somebody here is not really being completely honest with their feelings. I'll, I'll clarify that too. Let's just see what comes out with this. And what else can you share with the collective about this connection? Oh, thank you. Getting to know each other. Yeah, exactly. That's that Two of Cups energy. It says, enjoy discovering new commonalities, goals, and dreams as you get to learn more about each other. So you're you're like in a period of getting to know somebody. Okay, or you will be. If that's what you want, you know, if you're if you're ready. And then we have vivid dreams. It says, pay attention to your dreams as the connection deepens, your dreams become more pronounced and full of answers. Okay. Do one more, and then I'm gonna clarify mass. One more spirit. Thank you. Higher self. It says no matter how dark or muddy your path may be, trust the guidance of your higher self. Okay. So continue to listen to your intuition. You know, the guidance from your higher self throughout this journey. Throughout, you know the situation throughout your life spirit can you tell me about mask okay so let me just pull. yeah so we have the ten of wands so someone in this connection is putting on a front for sure Tell me more spirit about this Ten of Wands. I see the Five of Pentacles. Okay, so these could be past issues that, um, you know, possibly prevented you two from getting to know each other. All right, maybe, you know, how, how I was saying in the beginning, like you had to overcome, you know, whatever issues were holding you back in love, fear of abandonment, whatever. Um, it kind of feels like this is what that was. Somebody was wearing a mask, not really being themselves, so it was hard to connect to another person. So this could be, you know, this could be a message saying, um, that's what you need to work on. If you're not doing that and you want to connect to somebody, you need to, you know, be real with yourself, be honest with yourself. What do you want to love? Ask yourself those difficult questions. Why are you pushing people away? Why don't you want to need to know somebody? Why are you rushing I'm also seeing someone may self-sabotage relationships and things a little too quickly um, out of fear. So you may need to take some time to rest and recuperate from your previous relationships. It could even be, you know, from childhood. I see the ten, or this is the, <laughs> I said ten. This is the Ace of Cups and then the Wheel of Fortune, okay? So I see, like... Um, also, if you currently are going through a period where a spirit has you just kind of resting from from love or relationships, take time. You know, enjoy that me time. Enjoy being single. 
okay and you know take time to work on yourself love on yourself because the more and more you do that you're gonna start to really see the type of love that you deserve you know some of you have been settling with that five pentacles um settling for relationships that don't really serve you people that are not really benefiting you in any way and you know playing yourself that's what i'm seeing somebody has been really depriving themselves of real connections deep you know love that you could have at this time so if spirit's been asking you to just relax and you know focus on you do that it's going to be so beneficial okay so i'm going to leave this one here i hope it was helpful thank you guys for your love and your support and i will talk to you later okay bye